Elias, behind me is the Residence du Havre. But what, as you can see from these astonishing images, really not much is left of it. Uh, just an elevator shaft and a facade right now, a charred and icy facade. Uh, search crews are resuming their search this morning, their grim search for any other victim, sifting through mostly frozen debris. And as, as it stands now, Siltes Quebec have confirmed five dead, but about 30 still missing. But really, at this point, officials do fear the worst and it has been an extremely big challenge for firefighters and crews here to actually do their job it is at least minus 30 and the winds are brutal making this effort extremely extremely difficult uh, at the residence uh, most of the, the residents who lived here were over the age of 85 confined to wheelchairs and walkers about 20 managed to get out safely there's a team of psychologists on the ground here that are working at a nearby school offering moral support and comfort to the friends and family members of victims an investigation into the cause of the blaze is under investigation is underway rather it's still a mystery at this point, but we do expect an update on the situation from the Sulte de Quebec at around 9 this morning. Elias? Thank you so much, Laura. That's our Laura Casella in Lille Verde. Just a tragic story unfolding there.